The show must go on for thousands of Australians who work in arts and entertainment. The government has announced a $250 million relief package to help the industry recover from crippling coronavirus restrictions. Singing star Guy Sebastian welcomed the financial support on behalf of the industry. I've got my bass player Adam here who would gig eight times a week and, and that really has dried up to, to nothing and it's people like him, it's like all the people that you mentioned, people who are doing the rigging, people who are driving trucks, there's a whole ecosystem under an artist like myself and so many others. The projectors have been switched off for more than 10 weeks but the big screen is making a return as cinemas around the country prepare to reopen. We're operating at approximately 25-30% capacity across our auditoriums, which while not ideal, uh, is, is manageable uh, for, a, for a reopening period. The Golden Globes is the latest showbiz event to be postponed due to coronavirus. The ceremony, which kicks off Hollywood's award season, will now take place on March 1st. Tina Fey and Amy Poehler are hosting the glittering show. It was only last week the Academy Awards announced next year's ceremony will be pushed back to April. Disgraced comedian Bill Cosby has been granted the right to fight his 2018 sexual assault conviction. The 82-year-old has been in jail in Philadelphia for almost two years after a jury convicted him of drugging and sexually assaulting a woman in his home in 2004. It's been seven years since ARIA-winning rock band Eskimo Joe released new music. Now the boys are back to say something with new music. Say something, say something. Eskimo Joe's new single Say Something is available now. And that's your wrap of what's happening in showbiz.